Social Oomph Tutorial for Beginners 2022 Social Automation Tool Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use Social Oomph, which is a social media manager, and how to automate your social media posts. So let's get into it. Now, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go on to socialoomph.com and then you're just going to click on sign up for free over here. Now, once you do that, we're just going to enter our email address over here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to enter just my details. You're going to enter your usernames. It's going to be Jane Doe. We're going to add our password on to here. You're going to repeat your password. After that, you just have to add your first name and your last name. So the setup process is pretty simple. And then you have to select your time zone. So you can select any time zone that you want. Then you're gonna add the robot section and then you're just gonna click on register free account. So this is how easy it is to uh, register your account. Now I have a dash in my name, username, so I'm just gonna remove that. And now I'm just gonna verify my account. And now I'm just going to add my password once more. And now I have registered my account. Now, after that, I'm just going on to my email address and I'm just going to open that up and verify my email to the Social Oomph platform. So this is just going to take a couple of minutes to set up my account. And once you have set up your account, there are so many different features that Social Oomph allows you to do. And it really does help you in automating your social media accounts after you have finished the initial setup process. So now my social management account has been verified. So I'm just going to log in over here with my email and I'm just going to enter my password and now I'm just going to log in. And now you can see over here, I have logged into my social oomph dashboard. Now on the top, you have your basic navigation plane where it has your social profiles, your blogs, your network apps. Then you have your posting. So all of your scheduled posts, queued posts, different queues that you have, webhooks, RRS feeds, bulk upload posts, or tags are available over here. After that, you have your active team. So if you have different teammates, you can add them over here. And then you have your pricing and account settings as well. Now, if I go on to my social network, I'm just gonna go on to social profiles and you can just start setting up your social profile by connecting on connect social profile. And you can just say connect Facebook page and I'm just gonna connect a Facebook page. So what I'm going to do, and I'm just gonna go on to Facebook and you can find all of this data on your Facebook page. So uh, once you do that, you can fill this out and connect your Facebook page. Now, if you want to add maybe like a uh, Pinterest application or anything like that, you can just copy and paste from the Pinterest platform itself. So after your social networks, you have all your blogging platforms as well. So you can just click on blogs and you can click on connect blog over here and you can say connect WordPress blog. So we're just gonna click on blogs and we're gonna connect our blog from here. And if that is not working, you can just go on to social profile and link a WordPress social profile. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go on to social profiles and I'm just gonna click on connect social profile. I'm gonna click on connect Discord channel. And then you can see you have your channel name and webhook URL. So you're just going to open up Discord and copy and paste that onto the social Loom platform and you will be ready to go. So once you have done that, you can just click on schedule posts or you can schedule whatever you want. So depending on the platform you have, and these are the only supported platforms. So Discord, Facebook, LinkedIn, Pinterest, Reddit, Twitter, all of the basic ones. So if you have a Facebook post, you're just going to click on new Facebook post and then to post in the Facebook page, or you can save in your Facebook queue if, if you want, if you want to queue your posts, then you're gonna add your post text. So if this is a text post only, you're gonna add text. If you want to add images, you can do that. And if you want to add videos, you can also do that, but you can only add one video for one post using Social Oomph Media Manager. So you're gonna only be able to add like one video in a Facebook post. And that is one limitation that I do find with Social Oomph. You can't add multiple videos to a singular post, which some people might find irritating but it, it is decent enough for the free version of social oomph now what i'm going to do is i'm going to add my text post hey welcome back and then you can add when to publish it so you can choose a specific date and time and you can publish it at the this date and time you can enter it from the calendar and you can enter the time manually 
and if you want you can publish it right now so it's published immediately and then you can automatically add a destruct time so maybe if you're running a clearance sale but you don't want customers later on to see that you ran a clearance sale and for people to devalue your items then what you're going to do is you're just going to add like a clearance sale uh, post and then you can click on automatically delete post from facebook and then you can add when the specific time is so maybe you want this to end after two weeks so after two weeks you want to automatically destruct this post so you can do that and automatically delete certain posts that you don't want for on your social media account for a longer time so this is how easy it is to schedule your posts now after that i'm just going to give you guys an overview of the pricing of social oomph so social oomph starts at the basic suite version which is the personal suite which is available for free where you can connect one social profile you get access to your personal area you have basic posting featured you can schedule unlimited posts which i find to be a especially useful feature so i can schedule posts way ahead of time and then you also have three posts per hour. That is a limitation, but honestly, who is even posting more than three posts every hour? So you can just post twice every hour using social oomph, and then you have free customer support, And but you still cannot add multiple social media accounts on the free version. Now, after that, they have the advanced suite, personal suite, and business suite, which start at $15 monthly, $25 and $55. So on their advanced suite, they have one blog, so one social profile. You have one team with self as sole associate. You can get access to personal and team areas. You can schedule unlimited posts. You have access to all posting features and you can add a maximum of 60 posts per hour on per social profile or blog. So you can be uploading 60 posts on a singular Facebook page and posting 60 blogs at the same time using social oomph on these advanced suite version. Now on the professional suite, which starts at $25, you have all of these features, including five blogs and 10 social profiles. So that's like the basic difference between all of these is that you can link 10 social profiles for $25 on the professional suite of social oomph. And with the business suite, you have $55 and you can add 20 social profiles on a singular account including 10 blogs as well. So this is what the overview of social oomph is. I hope you guys found this video helpful and you're now able to get started on social oomph to get your social media management needs fulfilled. We are about to end this video and to end it on a good note I would like to request you guys that if you found this video helpful or if you found this method exactly what you wanted or what you were looking for consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and sharing it with your friends and family who might learn a thing or two from this video or learn a thing or two from the hundreds of videos that we have on our channel and of course if you have any questions any queries about anything in this video or with related to our entire channel or any of our videos make sure to leave a comment down below and ask us what you want from our videos i tried to cover everything i could in this video but if you want to see more details of the methods or the ways in this video just let me know in the comments down below and I'll be sure to make more videos on your suggestions. At the end of the day, it's all about providing you guys with valuable content that could help instill a positive change in your life and hopefully your friend and family's life as well. And at the end, I would like to request you to make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel as it helps out our videos a lot. And again, thank you so much for watching. Till next time, goodbye.